Hey, I wanted to talk to you about buttons. And not the kind of button on your shirt, man. Harmonica buttons. Now, <clears throat> this is a custom button that I designed and had cut by a lathe operator. It was made out of aluminum. And it was cut off of bar stock, which is a bar of aluminum that spins on a lathe. And um, of course, it, the slide fits into the hole just like yours does. They're all glued in. Usually epoxy, Swan uses epoxy, some of them use a form of crazy glue. And um, you get them off by taking needle nose pliers and wrapping the tines with tape and then taking this out, putting woods on both sides like popsicle stick wood on both sides of the slide, tape it, put the tines here and smack it with a hammer right here and comes right off and then you put the other one on. But you see, this slide, no matter what angle you touch it at, whether it's like this, or whether it's like this, or like this, or like this, or like this, and I mean, I do all of them. It just kind of depends where my hand's at, you know? And this kind of is nice because for fast speed, you're pivoting off the elbow. I like that one too. It's a little slower with the hand, I think. Although this one's kind of nice because you can shape your sound better, you know. Shaping your sound, it works when you're talking too. Anyhow, you want a, a button that is comfortable to your hand at every angle of activation of the slide. Most slides are poorly designed. They actually have a, a rim and some of them are concave and it bites into your finger. It hurts. It makes no sense. It, this is the way it should be. So anyway, that's the shape. And you'll find that it's whole bunches more comfortable. Whole bunches more comfortable. See ya.